It'll be Lions football to start the second half, and they trail here as we get back underway on EA Sports. And he will not bring it out. It's a touchback. The Lions offense now with a football first here to begin quarter number three. And that first half, one to forget really on both sides of the ball. They got to find some way to string something together here, don't they? Yeah, they're down big right now. So as you mentioned, trying to find something to string together, get some consistency, something sustained, maybe calm their whole team down and find a way to get back in this one. Yeah, because right now you're down big, you're being shut out. Let's see if this is the drive that kind of kickstarts them. That winds up pushing him back 11 yards on the sack. And that'll bring up third. So one quick, easy analysis about why they've struggled so far. They keep putting themselves in third and long situations. They just took another sack right there. And the offensive film session tomorrow may be a little longer than it normally is. <laughs> Not a lot of positive grades will be handed out thus far. Eluding the pressure right. The defense rising to the challenge and setting them back on the sack. It's been a tough one all game long for this offensive line. They're already down big, and now you know they're just going to come after the quarterback in a big way, don't you? Yeah, that old, they just can't get out of their own way right now. It's created an avalanche, and an avalanche is coming right on top of them. And he's able to get it out quickly, and this is not a bad kick here. And he'll take it on this side of midfield. It'll be a 44-yard punt. The return goes for eight. And they will take over first and ten. So now the Dolphins set to take over on offense. They've got the lead right now, and remember, they are riding that very impressive seven-game winning streak, trying to push it to eight. Marino will look to throw on first. He's just going to dump this one off to his fullback out of the backfield. And he's taken down, but not before reaching the 10-yard line. So now, following the big play, they've got a first and goal all the way down at the 10. Now, here's a look for the end zone, but that one's going to wind up incomplete. I know coaches tell us all the time that having a powerful arm isn't the number one thing they look for in a quarterback. But when you're trying to throw inside routes and you need to put some heat on it, it helps have the big gun. In this case, just a little bit too much. He's got it. Touchdown, Dolphins. A great play there. Two catches, two touchdowns here so far. And the Dolphins extend their lead yet again. Well, on the other sideline right now, it's just absolute dejection. But, Charles, let's focus on the positive. With the lead that they've built here, they've done pretty much everything to perfection in this ball game. They certainly have. Makes me think that their week of preparation was excellent. And they flowed into this game, and it carried over. And right now, I don't expect them to back off at all. They're playing so well, they just want to keep it going. The kickoff team on the field now as they will send this one away. And from back there, a wise move. He'll just sit on this one, and it'll come out to the 25. The Lions offense ready to kick off their next drive. And here we are almost through three quarters of play, and this passing game still has not really found any kind of rhythm. Put it mildly, because they're not even over 100 yards yet. And in today's NFL, where it's a pass-first league, that is quite surprising. Not many teams patient enough to stick with the run. Everybody wants to advance the ball through the air. They've got to get their timing back. They follow up the gain of five by only getting one there on second down. These guys have punted four times already, and they're staring at a fifth, barring a conversion here on third down. They'll look to throw. And a quick throw here, that's complete. Finding room at midfield. And he'll have it past midfield almost to the 40 before being taken down. A big play that time on the catch and run. And it's going to yield a new set of downs. And as they come to the line, they will not be able to get off another play as time has run out on this third quarter. We'll return with more after this. This is the NFL, and it's on EA Sports. And that would off the mark behind him, incomplete. And that's another play that's painted the picture of this game overall. It's been a blowout. It's been continually fueled by big turnovers and stops for one side and an inability to advance the ball. And the Dolphins' rush gets home. Down he goes. They push him back eight yards that time on second down. 
And this offense on third down today, they've converted a third of their opportunities, three for nine. This will be a tough third and 18. And pressure coming, and they got him once again. It's a loss of 10 on the sack, and it leads to fourth. Here comes the Lions punter now as he's on for the fifth time here today. So the Lions in possession of the football as we welcome you back. They come up on a fourth down situation with things not looking particularly rosy. And he deserves a bronze leg as he gets this one away. Taking it about the 16. It's a 40-yard punt, six yards on the return, and it will be first and 10 as they take over. Miami set to take over. Well, CD, you and I do a lot of games together, but it is pretty rare that we do a game of this margin. I mean, this has just been total domination from start until now, and I don't think they're going to take their foot off the gas at this point. Do you think that on the sideline, some jokester said to one of his teammates, maybe a few of them, Hey, we're up 50. Why not go for 100? You think maybe that line was under on the sideline? I can't believe what we're seeing here. An NFL game this lopsided. So the yellow flag came out, and that leads to a new set of downs for this offense, first and 10. And Marino actually going to look to throw it. Wide open receiver complete. And he will get into the end zone. It's another touchdown. This thing is ugly. Boy, he has been fun to watch throwing the football in this one. It's certainly not fun for that defense, though, Charles. Now up to four touchdown passes in this ball game. Yeah, we're supposed to be neutral, but I'm feeling their pain right now because he has absolutely carved up this secondary. A clinic on how to attack a defense and take them out of the game point after right down the middle and this one was over a while ago as they just add on to that big lead the kicking team out for Miami as they will send this one away and no thought to bring this one out he'll just go down to a knee and they'll take over at the 25 the Detroit offense ready to begin their drive well, I think that the folks here had hoped that maybe this home atmosphere would carry their guys to a surprise victory, but it does not appear that that's going to be the case. There's too much to handle on the other side in this one. So following the incompletion, here's second and 10 from the 25. He'll look to throw, and that is incomplete. At this point in the game, they've got to continue to try anything they can. They're still working at it, even though this one feels like a lost cause. Out of the gun now on third down. Ball oh, had his hands on it, couldn't bring it in. Pretty symptomatic of how this game's been going. Here comes the Lions punter now, as they're forced to kick for the sixth time today. It's taken to the 26. A nice job getting free on the return for 13 yards. And out will come the offense as they take over. And they'll come out with a three tight end look on the first play of the drive. They begin with a run by Smith. Oh, an absolutely filthy juke. He's got some space now. The 20, 10. 172 yards rushing for him here as he starts to draw closer to a thousand yard campaign. Big run here in the fourth as they continue to wear down this defense. And that's when the offensive line coach clicks onto the headset and says, head coach, offense coordinator, let my guys fire out and hit people. We're wearing them down. Let's finish them off with the running game. Clock counting down toward 40 seconds as they take the knee. It's second and goal, back to the eight-yard line now. And they take a knee. Third and goal as they look to pour some more salt in the wound. He fakes a spike. And this is caught. 